The newest students at Georgetown University, a group of inmates from nearby prisons in Maryland. The Georgetown Prisons and Justice Initiative is leading this five-year program. It lets the prisoners earn bachelor's degrees while they're behind bars. It gives inmates an opportunity for higher education. The inmates say the chance to earn a degree gives them new purpose. CBC's Shamari Stone was there when classes began. This program absolutely, absolutely gives me hope. Uh, it, it lets me know that there is light at the end of this tunnel. Dorian Grogan has been in prison for the last 17 years, serving a 42-year sentence after pleading guilty to armed carjacking and kidnapping. I heard an innocent person, you know, someone that had no reason to, to be hurt. He's one of 25 inmates selected statewide by Georgetown University based on academic preparation and the ability to succeed in a rigorous college program. I feel elated. Um, I'm happy that that, um, I can represent my family on one end. Right now, Grogan is taking philosophy and statistics courses, working towards a social science degree. And how does a program like this help with recidivism? Uh, it creates opportunity, creates change, creates a pathway to change. We know we can go and look at all the data that tells us an individual that leaves our system with an education is 46% less likely to return. The program's director says he believes higher education in prison helps public safety. 95% of people in prison will come home one day. And my question is, how do we want them to be? Do we want them to be people who are simply just angry and stewing and violent and getting into trouble in prison? Or do we want them to be people who turned a corner? I won't be in prison forever. And when I do arrive home, uh, I want to be better. That way I can contribute to society rather than take away from it. The program will take five years to complete, and the program's director says at least 125 inmates will have earned bachelor's degrees. Now, it's all funded by a $1 million three-year grant from private donors. Chef? Shamari, how are these inmates selected for the program? Well, the inmates need to have a high school diploma and write an essay to the selection committee. Then they must answer questions from the Georgetown Prison Initiative panel. Chef? Shamari Stone live, Bethesda, Maryland.